of the biggest names in the game are on show as Messi faces up to Neymar at the iconic Maracanã in Rio. If all of that's not worth staying up for, well, then I really don't know what is. Plenty of attention on Neymar and Messi, two of the biggest names in the game, but incredibly, neither of them have won a major trophy with their nations as of yet. Collected by Lucas Paqueta, the man who has uh, scored in both the go-to guy for Brazil but they do have quality players throughout the rest of their team Lucas Paqueta in particular has been one of them yes Tite the uh, Brazil coach of those options both wonderful goalkeepers all on the right side of that defense while uh, Renan Lodi will be the player who will uh, gallivant further forwards and normally allows this man Neymar to tuck inside from the left perhaps an area that uh, Argentina will look to exploit Thiago Silva looked uh, a little bit slow in the semi-final success. I thought about making the foul himself, but already being on a yellow card. It's a lovely piece of skill already by Neymar. Just the flip, the touch, the awareness. And the start of the game. Richarlison trying to nod it down, chance! And another collision time, lobbying the referee for a yellow card, Christian Romero. He got very fortunate there, Romero, just the pace at which Richarlison closed him down. Now Messi, and danger, Rodrigo de Paul. Messi to Di Maria. Held up by Renan Lodi. Montiel. Here's Messi. Di Maria, Messi, they've worked that well. First real time we've seen that little circuit of quick field passing from Argentina that they like to try and employ. Both of these star men are on the turf. Quickly, I think it was certainly a foul on the Brazilian number. As he just tried to knock it past. Yeah, I don't think there's going to be too much trouble with him continuing the game. Brazil have it. Just over a quarter of an hour played at the Maracanã, nil-nil, and got possession, but then lost it. Paqueta. Neymar, that's going to be a free kick. Watch the assistant, he didn't give it at first, he waited, he waited. Only once Neymar went to ground, that he eventually... Never lost. That's a good pass, Di Maria could be in, what a chance! And what a finish as well! Argentina lead, thanks to a moment of magic from Uh, yeah, it's been... Uh, neither team's really took control. Neymar. Casemiro back to Fred. Paqueta. And Casemiro's... Leonel Scaloni's uh, used eight since the 2018 World Cup finals. But Emi Martinez... Uh, rise he's had in the past. Di Maria. Now Messi. Worked on for Acuna in a friendly in Saudi Arabia in uh, 2019, only goal of that game, scored by Lionel Messi. Since that defeat, across those 13 matches that they haven't lost, they've kept 10 clean sheets, conceding just four goals. They've been tough to breach, but came unstuck. 
Messi leading the charge now. Brazil have numbers back, but Messi's on the move. Well stood up by Marquinhos. Still got the effort in, though. Asking for the free kick, but I think that was good defending from Marquinhos. Yeah, it was. Play on the ball. And Neymar is over. That's a to the game. And that Neymar admitted he knows he's going to... And that he reckons they're going to fight the whole game if it happens. Well... Neymar to hit this one and hit it straight into the wall. Yeah, he just can't seem to get him in the game. Hasn't really got to the pace. The first 35 minutes. They've had more control of the game. They've seemed to... Danilo. Neymar invited the challenge. He kept his feet and his eye on the ball. Danilo. Colombia in the semis of the Copper, and after just seven games, looks to be the clear number one for Lionel Scaloni now. Casemiro. Not giving them the opportunity to get turned easily. Space for Di Maria. Now Messi. Los Elso. Oh, nearly. Oh, they're halfway there. Argentina looking to end a 28-year wait for a senior title. I think they've looked look like they, they have a game plan going forward. They're sharp, they leap into action, they do it from a good shape, whereas Brazil just haven't really got going in that first half, and I'm sure Tite will be trying to, to find an answer to that at half-time team talk. Argentina have lost the last six finals that they have played at senior level, four in the Copper America, one in the Confederations Cup, and of course, the World Cup final here is letting it run. Here's Messi, who will run. First time he's really had some open space in front of him. Offloads to Demon. Real intelligent play. Here's Messi. Lovely stuff, tees it up for Di Maria. Collected by Neymar. Oh, he was crunched there, advantage. Doesn't even need to look up because he knew the... Just to see where... I thought the studs were... Yeah, studs were low. Beat two or three players. So, uh, he will just uh, sit there. He actually got another head of Paredes in the last game. Here's Richarlison! Blocked well by Martinez. To bring the ball back into play rather than striding onto it comfortably. Still hits it really well. Hits it true, hits it strong. Casemiro's there. Thiago Silva. Neymar took the contact, and then did he make contact on Rodrigo de Paul for the free kick here that he was caught in the fan? I think Argentina players really close to the situation and wanting more action. Referee, I don't see it myself. I think when you're with the ball and holds the ball like Neymar does, you can't do it without your arms, you can't do it without your hands. That's just... Taken short. Here's Messi. Messi. Di Maria will chase. And red and low. Messi. Di Maria one way. Messi going in alone. Messi, brilliant stuff. Goes over. Doesn't get the decision. Brazil. I just think he just chose the wrong option. Di Maria making a terrific run. Really did make ground up on his right hand side. He had. Martinez on his left for security on that far side of the field. Messi was... <laughs> From it being a free kick, it's actually 
Dimitri Silico on, I think, from Lodi. I think he knows Messi's going to be running around Argentina. Di Maria finding Messi, looking for the angle for the shot, couldn't find it, but wrong man in the Ruiz from Argentina, although Brazil have come away with it. Neymar taking on De Paul and hauled down by him, that'll be a booking. Oh, let's get past him. He wasn't going to allow him to run and his centre horse with runners either side. Made sure it really difficult for a referee. Martinez, no foul there though. Neymar on the charge. Richarlison. Neymar. Oh, it, it might uh, come for Paqueta. That's a real yeah. drifting into those spaces for him. I think Messi was trying to find Firmino. Well, a strong challenge. Seemed like he got enough of the ball. Neymar went over, doesn't get the free kick. It's going to be a 20-minute uh, period that the referee is going to have to concentrate more than on the ball. And Montiel really went to ground early, but a great tackle. Neymar, collected by Messi. First time that Argentina have played a Copa America final in Brazil from winning. It started it off by Otamendi stepping right in. I don't think it's a day that certainly said, you're not getting by me. Made sure there was, I think there was an arm into the, into the ribs of Neymar. It goes... Gonzalez. Rodriguez sends it forwards. Here's Messi. This is the danger as Brazil pour forwards. Messi for De Paul. Messi wants it back. Here he is. Is this his moment? Oh no, it's not. Would you believe it? Martinez. Messi. Emerson's blushes. Neymar shrugs off the challenge. Messi stuck out of boot there. For the corner. Messi, beautiful stuff. Constantly stubborn. They're not giving much away. for Argentina the wait is over their first title since 1993 and they have done it in the backyard of their arch enemies celebration time for the Albi Celeste at the Maracanã and this is Lionel Messi's moment. He hasn't scored in the final. He has been the standout player in the tournament. And after so much talk about Messi having not been able to do it at international level, he can now toast a title with his country. It wasn't pretty, but they have got the job done. Disappointment for Neymar and Brazil, who had their opportunities, but the full-time score, Argentina 1, Brazil 0. Argentina are the 2021 Copa America champions. And just what they deserved. I thought Argentina were the better side. I thought, as I said, I thought they came out right from the first whistle, signalled their intent, real good pressure on Brazil, denied them any midfield position, uh, possession, made sure that they couldn't go through that area of the field. They were quite direct in the first half, Argentina got their rewards from it with a, a wonderful De Paul pass and that Di Maria. For Argentina, the wait is over! Their first Copa success since 1993, and they 
they've done it in the backyard of their big rivals, Brazil. What a night for the Albi Celeste. And Lionel Messi finally has a title.